All right, this is uh, New Spartan 13. We're back here on the channel. Uh, we're still at the Congo River. I was uh, doing a little scouting after I got off last time, and uh, I found a nice little spot here. I mean, it wasn't too far from where I was before, but uh, yeah, uh, we we're over here catching uh, what a tiger fish there. We were doing pretty good there and everything. I thought they were a decent fish and whatnot. Well, I moved over here a little bit by this buoy. And, uh, I mean, I'd seen people in, you know, random servers and stuff over here fishing and everything, but I really didn't pay attention to it too much. I thought the tiger fish was where it was at. But, uh, actually, uh, this spot right here, show you on the map here. Alright, we're down here in that lower section still, but we're right about here, and uh, we got some Nile Perch, so well, those uh, Nile Perch get quite big, and a lot of, a lot of XP, uh, actually it's better for the XP than it is for the money, so if you're uh, going to get the DLC and looking to level up, uh, I'm telling you, the, you know, the, the uh, Nile Perch are where, they're at, where it's at, so uh, definitely, you know, if you get the DLC and you want to level up, check out this spot. So, like I said, I just caught it randomly. I seen some guys over here fishing on a random uh, server, and I said, "Well, I'll give it a shot." So I, you know, came over and checked it out. But uh, no, I was gonna go and Blue Crab Island there and throw a line out there because I got 50, you know, level 54 and everything. But uh, one of the first Niles I caught with him with a trophy and it was like, I don't know, I want to say close to 20,000 XP on it, so, definitely, definitely worth a look, so, but, uh, so I'm just going to sit here and throw it out and grind on these guys a little bit and see if we can't catch a couple uniques in here because, uh, I don't even think, they claim that, uh, the uniques you can't even put in a strip, you know, put it in your keep net, so, I think the, Biggest Nile is uh that I've caught so far is like two hundred and eighty pounds. So I will throw it out there and give her a whirl. So yeah, thanks for all the guys checking out the channel now and stuff like that and if you're returning, I appreciate it and uh you know hit that follow and and we'll keep fishing here and see what we can catch. So, like I said, just trying to maybe hook up with a couple of uniques or something. But it don't takes about I don't know four or five fish to fill the keep net. So. Yeah, I'm still using the same bait, the large minnows, barbless hook, six out. Uh, pretty standard setup from what I've been using here at the Congo, anyways. Uh, I use the barbless so that up, you know, kicks up the XP also. And uh, right now I th I'm level 55, I think. And uh, just you know, these uh, now perch really, really kick up the XP. That's all I can say. I can't say it enough. But uh, if you're looking to, you know, buy a DLC that's going to get you ahead, I definitely recommend the Congo. As long, you know, it, the DLC comes with the pole and everything. You got the boat. Uh, the only thing you need to do is just, you know, go fishing. So I got this uh, DLC. It's a 30-day DLC. You get the premium. Uh, you get the Congo pass. You got another, I don't know, 10, what, 15, 20 days left on the pass yet. So... I mean, it works out good if there's a lake that you want to get to. That's you know, like if you're say you third, you know, right, you rank thirty, and you want to go to a the Mongo Mongolia there for forty eight. You know, I mean, it's just a real good jump on the XP. So, I mean, the money's good too. I average about a hundred thousand per fill up on the net. So.
Well, it was bad enough the other day in the rain, but uh, let's see what's going on here. I don't want that. Yeah, not really quite peak time yet, but. Come on, there you go. Alright. Might help it hit the right button, I guess, so. But that's alright, we'll, we'll get her. So. Yeah, I just hope that you guys are enjoying the game. Looking forward to the upcoming tournament, the trout there, so. Uh, I got a few hot spots that I've saved throughout the, you know, playtime and everything, so I'm gonna kinda jump around, hit them. A little closer to tournament time. And if there's any kind of drops or anything, I do the drops for, you know, planet, Fishing Planet here, so. Uh, I started doing fi uh, the drops for Fishing Planet just because I was trying to get them and I'd join in with somebody and they'd be on for a little bit of time and just get enough, just get close enough to get the drop and then they'd get off or something, so it's like, it just seems easier to get the drops just by you know putting it on the stream and going so plus I enjoy the game so that makes it yeah you know a twofer boy this spot's starting to make me out to be a liar by the looks but yeah and uh, don't don't put the anchor down you put the anchor down it's gonna take you forever to get them in Take you, you know, 10 15 minutes to get them in sometimes. So, what I do is get in the spot, drop the anchor. Oh, there we go. All right, we're hooked up. And uh, then, after I get to the spot, I hook, drop the anchor and uh, pick it back up so it stays in place. And then I go out and cast in the spot. And then, like right now, it's just kind of pulling along. So, it should be a pretty decent Nile. So, but then again, just a standard Nile will pull you pretty good. So they're like 150, 160 pounds at least. Yeah, he's way out there. He's probably, he might spool it. Holy cow! Yeah, he he's a he's a good fish. Yeah, he's he's got me. He's gonna spool it off. Oh no no no! He's come back. Oh wow! Oh, this one probably the best hookup I've had so far. So. I want to count my chickens before they hatch, because I tell you what, in this business, it don't take long to go from really good to really bad, so. Yeah, then he slacks out on you. You got to watch that slacking, because they'll come right at you, and you really got to fight to keep the slack, so. Well, keep it tight anyways. You don't want slack, but. Sometimes you got, yeah, see, right there, he just... I try to keep the line, uh, tip of the pole down as much as I can so that if he does slack, I can pull it straight back and make up for whatever slacks there and hopefully get the tension back on him. So, but I mean, everybody has their way of fishing. So, I mean, this just happens to be the way that I play it out. So, boy, this is, yeah, putting out a good fight, I'll tell you that. Come on, big boy. Let's see what you are here. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's a Nile, but as far as, you know, size-wise. Because i tell you what, the, the tiger fish the other day just weren't cooperating very well. We got a lot of African tigers, but we weren't getting many uh, Goliaths, so. And then I moved, and that was a bigger mistake, so. We'll just, just hook up here, and then... We're gonna stay right here for a little bit, and like I said, it's been treating me pretty good, so. Boy. Coming? No. There we go. Alright, so he's coming in pretty good now, so. We just gotta watch it because he'll slack you and leave, so. I thought he was gonna surface there from. There he is. Okay, nice. Yeah, he, he's a, he's a big one. Let's see what we got here. I don't believe he's a young one, that's for sure. <laughs> he could be, though. My luck. But we'll see. Yeah, you can hear that line twine a little bit when it 
pulls on them big, you know, big old boys. So, I mean, he's like right there, but he just don't want to give it up. So oh, there he is. Oh, that wow, wow, wow. He had a nice sight. Yeah, this has got to be a good one, guys. This is gonna be a good one. Let's see what we got here. Oh wow, oh, wow. See, what a disappointment. Oh my god. I really thought that was gonna be something. <sighs> yeah, he, I mean, about average, I guess. That that was a, like I said, <laughs> you never know until you get him into the boat. So, but I mean, he's a pretty cool looking fish. I mean, he reminds me of a bass, you know, just a, a giant bass. So, but uh, yeah, Nile perch. Uh, that one's 63 inches long. 152 pounds. That's just not what I was expecting, to be honest with you. Uh, it's still, I mean, almost 10,000 XP and $17,000, so you can't really complain about that. But like I said, uh, there's some definitely better ones when you get into the trophies up in here. And now we got to see if we can't get back to our spot here. Oh, we got a fish in the boat, so I guess you can't complain about, you know, too much. Let's zip it around here. Like I said, I just hit the anchor just to hold the spot for a minute. And then, uh, move into place there, and then I'll jump back again and hit the anchor, and it just holds you there so you're not floating all over the place. So, uh, there's a little bit of a current, I guess, in this spot here, so it kind of pulls you around a little. But, alright, let's try it again, see what happens here. Well, hopefully we get a fish anyways. Yeah, we're fishing in about 24 foot of water right here, so it's pretty deep. But I don't have to throw, but only about, like I said, about 40, 50 feet away from the boat there. There's like a little barrier at the end of the, the river here. You can only go so far and then you stop anyways, but pretty much butt right up against that and cast her out and... Nice. So I've seen some guys out here fishing it. This spot, you know, this area over here and everything. So I just kind of wandered over, put it on uh, private, and uh, wandered over and checked it out. And my first hookup I was sold. I was like, man, that, that's a that's a big fish right there. So and the XP, like I said, the money ain't as good as the tiger fish because the tiger fish are smaller, so you can catch more of them. But uh, the XP is definitely well worth it. There we go. Yep. You gotta watch it with that barbless because sometimes you'll hit, you'll yank it and it won't hook up. Yeah, see? That's another small, that's a smaller one there. Yeah. And he's still pretty good size 126 pounds, 59 inches long, $14,000 and 7,000 XP. So, I mean, it's well worth throwing the line out there, anyways. But, yeah, like I said, I kind of wanted to get over to Blue Crab there and get chasing some unique tarpon and stuff. But once I kind of glided over a little bit and hooked into these big boys, I was like, yeah, we're going we're gonna to hang here for a little bit. So, but make the most of it, you know. But we're going to go over there to Blue Crab, Willow, stuff like that and, you know, get grinding on that and stuff. So, I mean, I've been doing Fishing Planet for quite a while. I uh, just got really into it in the last six months here, so just grinding on it. And it, it takes a while. I mean, the DLCs help out a little bit here and there. But uh, I uh, started up from scratch probably, 
I don't know. Like I said, about six months ago, I was like level 20 or something. You know, just your average fisherman in there type thing, just hit and miss. But now, now that I put it onto the channel and stuff like that, I've been trying to get right up there and get in some of these better ponds. So, like I said, I'm kind of adding a couple other things to the channel here once uh, life kind of slows down a little bit. But right now, I'm pretty much sticking with fishing on the channel, so... The only thing I got time for right now, so. <laughs> but, uh. No, I was just, uh, hanging out, and I was like, you know what, I'll just get on for the guys here and show them what, you know, where I got to and how I've been hooking up, you know. Because generally I stream later and stuff, but, uh, I just had a little window right now to jump on and get some input out there. And, uh, right now I just don't have the availability for a schedule, but. Soon enough, I will. Oh, there we go. Yeah, oh, there. Nice. Okay. Yeah, might be another young one. Or, uh, like I said, sometimes they come right in. Uh, you know, so, I mean, they can pretty much do what they want. They're heavy enough. I'm running 83 pound test, and they're over 100. Some of them are well over 100, so they can just pretty much do what they want. Yeah, see, you get them right up next to the boat, and then he kind of takes off. Oh, yep, there you go. Alright, he'll come right in. Alright, what do we got? Yeah, young Nile Perch. Uh, he's only 2,000. I mean, 2,000 XP, 6,000 hours, 75 pounds there. But, and uh, they really, uh, a little bit of difference in size, I guess. You can see it, but, yeah, see, you can see the difference in the size right there. That's a, about almost 100 pounds difference between the other one that I caught there, the Nile Perch. So, like I said, it'd be nice to hook into a unique or a trophy or... But, uh... Like I said, this isn't really the high time either, so... Yeah, I got a little bit before I can go to the high time. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to pay to skip ahead, that's for sure. Uh, to me, that's not worth it. I mean, we're, we're catching them pretty decent right now. And, uh, I mean, you know, they don't fight as good as a sturgeon. I mean, those sturgeons really give you a run for your money down, but, uh, down at the delta there. But, uh, I like catching them. I mean, I like a good fighting fish, something that's not going to just come right in like a sunfish or something. And, uh, so, I like to get onto some target muskies and stuff like that, but. Eventually, I would, before the time runs out and stuff, probably do that exploration on the Congo here. And, uh, they got, you know, maybe go find that elephant fish or something. I thought that was kind of a funky looking fish, so. But no, there's a lot more coming to the channel. Like I said, it's just, I mean, I've been. Oh boy. Uh, I've been. Doing it for a while now and stuff, but just having the right setup makes all the difference, so. And usually if I get a chance to stream or something, that, you know, you got a house for or something like that, it's just not a good time. But. Yeah, you just got to watch your pole, your reel and stuff, because these guys really do some work on it. And uh, I think I got down to almost 40% on my rod, maybe 49, uh, 48, something like that on my reel. And it cost me, I had to leave the game, leave the the map and take and repair it all. It cost me like 30000 But that's to repair everything right to 100%, so you can't, you know. I mean, what what's thirty thousand when you're rolling in a thousand a trip, you know, or a hundred thousand? Excuse me, a trip. But uh, yeah, I just uh, like I said, just kind of walk, glided over through the line out there, just on the other side of that buoy there, and it just almost instantly nailed it. 
And I am I was just right over there, catching tigers, you know. <laughs> tiger fish. Oh, there we go. Ah, yeah, exactly. Ah. Yeah, that was a smart one right there. That's the problem, you know. Too smart for me. Couldn't, didn't want to take my bait. Ah, that's horrible. I'd like to get right on the other side of that buoy. That seems to be like the hot, you know, the hot spot for me. Right there. Yeah, so that's still in front of it, so that, you know. Yeah, I gotta put that anchor down because I'm kind of floating, so. I mean, you don't see nothing on the screen, but they're there. I mean, they hit it, so, I mean, obviously they're there, so. But when they do show up on the screen, they're all, they're big. <laughs> they're really good-sized fish, that's for sure. Yeah, I not only stream on uh, Twitch, I also upload the video onto uh, YouTube there. And uh, so if you're on YouTube and you're, you know, checking out the video and whatnot, uh, hit that sub button over there, hit, you know, hit a comment, let me know what you're thinking of the channel, uh, what route I should go maybe or something. But, uh, you know, I'm doing the fishing thing right now and uh, maybe later on moving to something else, but yeah, just leave a comment, you know, let me know what you guys are thinking about the channel, so. And uh, like I said, I just wanted to jump on for a minute here and catch a few and see what you guys thought. Oh, there we go. Ah, damn. Missed him again. So. And, uh, but yeah. No, uh, this is the spot. I mean, if you're looking for XP, hit the Congo. Definitely, definitely check out this spot, so. But yeah, I got to get going. Uh, that'll do it for now on the Spartan channel here. And uh, hit that follow, hit that sub, like, dislike. Uh, just let me know what you're thinking. So, All right, guys. Take care. Catch you on the next one.